Uh, kia ora koutou and welcome to this update from the 3 Minute Board Games channel. Uh, you can see I'm joined by the third member of our team, Anne. Um, and the purpose of this video is really just to talk about this year and the challenges that we've had and why you've probably seen a lot less content out of the channel than you have in the past. To start it all off, uh, early in the year, Steph had a gallbladder um, basically explode on her. So she had to spend a, a week in hospital, that's while she was pregnant. So we had to take some time out there. Then this one was born. And as you can imagine, um, newborns take up an awful lot of time. So um, she also had jaundice and uh, that meant we were having to feed her every three hours. So a lot of a lot of sleep deprivation, that, that was some rough time. Um, Anne was also born with a hole in her heart. Um, and that meant that she had to have surgery um, at about three months old. And we had to fly up to Auckland, stay in a different city for two weeks, um, stressing out constantly about open heart surgery. So yeah, she, she had to go on a bypass machine. They had to um, you know, fix fix the big hole, but it's all fixed now. And um, she's all good. And you know, she's just a real bouncy, happy, engaged girl. Ah. She's like looking at the camera going, oh, what's going on here? Uh, you're being a video star, love. Um, then we decided that um, because of Anne and because of the channel, our little house just wasn't wasn't up to snuff anymore. So we had to sell it, and to sell it, we needed to redecorate it. So we had to move out of our house for a couple of weeks uh, while redecorators came in and redid the carpets, redid the walls, and that involved living out of suitcases. Then we had to um, have the house dressed for sale. So all of our stuff got put in storage, including you know most of my games and my video making equipment uh, which just made that whole process of making videos way harder than it had been in the past um, and I had to pack away my green screen my lights I was literally shooting off like a tiny table with no lightings for the last couple of videos which is why you might have noticed that the photos aren't quite as good as they had been in the past but we're hoping to sort that out then we had to sell the house um, and we did that under uh, level 4 lockdown restrictions in New Zealand, which meant that um, it was all done virtually. Uh, it was it was really, really bizarre. Um, then we had to buy a house and move into it. And that's the stage we're at now. We've, we've bought the new place um, and we're in it. I'm not actually sitting in the house. What I'm doing right now is I'm sitting in the Whare Kemu, which is a te reo Māori for the Games House, which is a separate small house attached to... Uh, at the back of the uh, main property that is going to be entirely for board gaming and making videos for the channel. So while this um, year's been really, really rough for getting stuff done, next year's gonna be a hell of a lot better. And we're gonna have a permanent setup for uh, the lighting. We're gonna have a permanent table. We've got all the games up on display. It's going to be a great place and a great space um, for us to make some stuff for the channel. And um, I'm going to do an unboxing video that'll come out a couple of days after this one where I get every single game that I've had in storage. So it's about 400 games and we put them up on the shelves. But that's done. I've done that. And I'm just going to spin the camera around really quickly to give you a bit of a teaser on the state of the room at the moment. So just slowly pan that around. Yeah, we're high budget here. And I'll just bring that one back. Oh, and he's busted it. It's a lot harder making videos with, with while you're holding a baby than, than it isn't. Anyway, um, Three Minute Board Games has had a bit of a down year this year because we just had so much going on. Next year's gonna be a, a bigger and brighter one. So if you enjoy what we do, like, share, subscribe to the channel, and come support us on Patreon. Uh, it makes all this kind of stuff possible. And next year, we're going to be adding more kit, we're going to be improving our techniques, and hopefully I'll be able to put out more content because it's going to be easier to make. We've got this huge space to work in. Before I was working out of one small bedroom, which had all my games in it, and I had to pack the lights away each and every time I made a video and move the table. It was a complete nightmare and just that inertia when you're trying to do something and before you start making a video, you have to move the table out of the way. You have to put stuff away from it. You have to set up the lights. You have to get them right and then start working. 
and that's like a just it's a barrier it's a psychological barrier to getting anything done so hopefully that barrier will be gone once this place is fully set up and uh until next time until we get a, a proper recap video out uh take care everyone and that's goodbye from myself and goodbye from man she's not she's not looking at the camera now